Hello humans, how art thou today? I'm doing pretty dandy myself. Uh, just giving you a... Hello dear. I guess she wanted to come and join us too. So, little Luna Chan here wants to hang out with us for a hot second. So yeah, uh, this week's video is going to be another movie review video of a recent movie that's been out for about a week now. Um, I have still not found any cherries. Oh jeez. Alright. Hello. Alright, so I've not found any cherries yet for my movie review. I'm going to this back a little bit. Maybe we can actually see the YouTube sensation as, as, known as Josh Meow, if I could talk right. All right, come on. You don't. You know what you're doing. All right, stop. Okay. So, anyways, um, yes. So I'm gonna be doing a movie review video today. Uh, next week's gonna be another. Is it worth it? I'm working on that now. Hopefully, finding some cherries for the cherry picker or cherry chomper, I guess I could say. Um, but yeah. So the movie that I'll be reviewing is going to be Happy Death Day. Now, um, I actually enjoyed that movie a lot more than I thought I would. I enjoyed that movie more than uh, Blade Runner, which is pretty crazy. Um, I thought, okay, this movie's not really my style. The horror, horror genre is not really my style all that much because it's pretty much cliche. When you meet Cass, Cass gets killed, bad guy gets defeated. Um, maybe there's a survivor, most likely most of them all die. Don't get connected to the cast. So, yeah, that's why I normally don't like horror movies. So anyways, um, yeah, Happy Death Day, moving on to that. It's more of a splash, of, has a lot of splash of comedy into it, which I really like, because I like to laugh a little bit, we all do. Um, so yeah, so when he starts out, and as you see in the previews, this girl kind of wakes up, and she's kind of a, an asshat, um, you know, just kind of a terrible person in general, uh, but she has her reasons, of course. And uh, basically, uh, this is not a spoiler, because you kind of know she dies, um, basically you, she wakes up in the movie, or, you know, she goes through some stuff, and then she ends up dying in the movie. Um, and you think, oh, great, she's dead, that really sucks. Hello. And, um, after that, uh, it's a hor hor horrific death, and then she ends up waking up alive again. Like, it's a nightmare, and she's like, holy crap, that was terrible. I'm, she's with this dude, and whatever. And, um, you know, she moves on, and then, um, she kind of goes through her day again, and everything seems like deja vu, deja vu. And then she ends up dying again. But uh, kind of a little bit different, but for the most part the same. And the whole movie is uh, extremely rem reminiscent of Groundhog's Day with Bill Murray in it from back in the day. But in like a horror version of the Groundhog's Day, which is uh, it's really, really cool and really funny. So it has a lot of pieces of humor in it, a lot of pieces of horror. Um, it's very suspenseful. has a lot of twists in it. I won't go too much deeper into that except for... Um, she keeps waking up after dying, and she wants to figure out, you know, <clears throat> how she could stop herself from dying. And uh, there's been there's a couple of red herrings in the show, and you're like, holy crap! Like, you know, this is it. I got it. I got it. I got this under control. And then poof, she's dead. Um, or poof, she wakes up the next day, and she's like, really? Are you serious right now? So yeah, it's a really good movie. Um, I'm gonna rate it an eight and a half out of ten. Uh, there's not really poof, much poof, cat poof. cat hairs everywhere. Ah! You can't see it, but I can. Uh, poof! Uh, oh god to my eye um so yeah y there's not really that much wrong with it there's a few pieces that could be uh, a little bit better a little few pieces that are a little unrealistic in it other than the, whole, the groundhogs part um a couple of you know scenes and whatnot but um other than that i think you guys would really enjoy the movie and i highly recommend you're gonna go see it bring somebody with you because you definitely want to laugh with a friend or a girlfriend or boyfriend or fiance or whatever um wife husband um because there are some significantly funny parts in that thing, in your, that movie, and you're going to be like, wow, I'm really liking this. So give it some time, because when you first sit down, you know what's going to happen. And so the first 20 minutes are kind of boring. You're like, okay, come on. All right, killer. Let's move on. Uh, but then it just gets better and better and better. And it, it really is like Groundhog's Day, so I highly recommend it. Um, other than that, so there's not much more to say about that movie, so I'm not going to dig into it. It's really a very simplistic plot. Um, it has good music throughout the movie. Um, again, there's a lot of laughing. All the actors and actresses are relatively unknown which is nice and keeps everything fresh the film ended up only costing like under 10 million to make and it's already grossed like six times that amount uh it, it already crushed blade runner um it, it knocked blade runner right off the thing and ended up topping the weekend so i highly advise you guys to check it out this weekend maybe next weekend while there's still people going to see it um that way oh let's get a little in there you guys can... there you go oh wow so oh shoot i screwed that up big time didn't i Man, ah, there we go um yeah, I highly advise you guys see it while there's still popularity, you know, with the whole movie, because you want to laugh with other people and all that good stuff. Um, 
so yeah, pretty much that's that's all I got for that movie. Um, I appreciate you guys all liking, commenting, subscribing, and sharing, and uh, you know helping my channel grow. It's been significantly growing the last uh, month or so, and I really appreciate that. Um, next week is going to be an Is It Worth It? I got a few things on the docket. Uh, oh, geez, honey. Um, and then after that, I'm looking for some more ideas for challenge videos. Nothing too crazy, nothing too gross or annoying, but things that are going to be extremely entertaining to you guys. So um, if you have any ideas, that would be great. Let me know. Uh, if you just want to stop by and see this beautiful little Luna Chan, by all means, uh, you can let me know that she's the whole purpose of you watching my channel. Because... Uh, uh, Luna is life, meow. But okay. Other than that, so look at that little smile. Isn't she so cute? Let's just let's just freeze frame for this moment here. Ooh. Oh yeah. Ooh. Okay. All right, guys. So thank you all again, like for liking, commenting, subscribing, and I will see you all next week with some sort of is it worth it? And then again, uh, the following week we're gonna have some other stuff that's gonna hopefully be a challenge video. And you guys take care, meow. <laughs>